they have to know I have to have it or I wouldn't have the thing. And they just go ahead and take it anyway. Now to the story of a local Vietnam veteran who's really now housebound after somebody stole his electric scooter. The 73-year-old and his wife live in the Image, which is a neighborhood of northeast Vancouver where the scooter was stolen yesterday morning. Our Amy Frazier is here now with this crime alert and a very frustrating story. Yeah, medical issues make it nearly impossible for Don Yule to even walk across the street. Well, about six months ago, he bought a used electric scooter so he could get out of the house and do more with his wife and friends. Don has nerve damage related to diabetes. He can't feel anything in his left leg, and he has a lot of back pain. Without something to lean on every few feet, sometimes his legs even give out. Well, he finally, finally kind of accepted that a scooter was a way for him to stay active, to visit with friends, or even grocery shop with his wife. Wednesday morning at about 5.30, his wife was leaving for work when she saw someone had broken into their truck in the driveway. The scooter in the back was gone. And that's the part that bothers me, that people would do that, especially when they have to know I have to have it or I wouldn't have the thing. And they just go ahead and take it anyway. Well, neighbors heard what happened, and they've started posting the story on social media, hoping to find another electric scooter they might be able to get for Don. Family members are also watching online for the stolen one. It looks like this one, but the color is blue. It's a Golden Technologies lightweight. Don bought it used for about 450 bucks. If you know anything about this crime, contact Vancouver Police. Back to you. Oh, I hope they can find it. Thanks, Amy.